Alright guys, um, as promised, I would do a tutorial on my quality, and a lot of you like it, so let's get started on it. First off, I'm going to go through Total Media Extreme, um, I record with an HD PVR, my input is YPR PV RCA back for my audio input, and two channel stereo for my PC audio mode, but that's not really important. Let's go to device settings. That's I keep it the same. And format settings. This is where um this is the highest you can really go, and that's what I use because I have a good computer. You want to record at 1280 by 720 at 60 frames per second. Um, don't click any of those. Contrast bitrate. Luma 3, Chroma 3. Use AC3 audio encoder encoder my bad and apply and okay now that and I record in PlayStation 3 which makes it into TS which is supported to um Vegas but it doesn't really matter if you click Xbox or PlayStation 3 but I just like PlayStation 3 more whoops um on to Vegas my hold on my properties are HDV 1080 60 i 1440 by 1080 20.970 frames per second. Um, that's YouTube HD and with 1440 by height 18 1080. My bad. Upper field first 1.333 HDV 1080. Um, zero original output rotation 29. Point 970 NTSC 32 floating bit full range 1.000 linear quality resolution best Gaussian Gaussian I don't know how to say that none um, adjust source start all projects with this apply go to audio click stereo 0 40 44 1 44,100 uh, bit desk 16 resample and stretch quality best apply okay now on to just I'm gonna import a clip oh man sorry import just find a oh, crap sorry guys I'm having difficulties okay drag that in there my pan and crop is no black lines whatsoever for an HD PVR I'll um, just copy these down um, with 1267.8 height 715.0 X center 640.5 Y center 362.5 angle 0.0, .0 Y X center 640.5 and Y center 36.5 362.5 sorry uh, I'm kind of nervous during this. I don't know why. Save that as a preset. Go to right click it. Go to properties. Go to maintain aspect ratio. Unclick that and disable resample. And that'll get it. no um, black bars whatsoever. Um. Now on to that's basically the quality right now. Go to this will be the color correction to make it the color stand out more. Um, brightness. You'll need brightness and contrast. Sharpen and then just do reset to none. You don't need to do anything to that. Soft contrast and saturation adjust. And I'll give you these settings for brightness and contra contrast. You need to go 0 0.07. Um, for bright contrast, you need to go 0 0.12. Contrast center 0 0.50. Just copy those down. If you need to pause the video, if I'm going fast, I'm sorry. Um, sharpen 0 0.000. Soft contrast, you need to go stretch range 17.80, contrast 66.53, diffusion 15.25, low trim 0, high trim 0, tint 0, contrast hue 0, and I the saturation adjust which pulls out the colors. Amount all the way up to one um, center to 0 0.2500, spread 0.5000. 
low negative 0 0.7500 and high all the way up to a thousand and it should look like this you get the idea of it. But um, now onto the render settings. I render in WMV because I had a lot of trouble with um MP4. After a while, it became the audio became lag, like uh, sound lag. But go to Windows Media Movie Video V11 WMV. Go to custom, go to include audio, mode CBR, format, Windows Media 9, Audio 9.2, attributes 192kbps 48kHz um, to stereo AV CBR. Go to video, go to CBR, Windows Media Video 9, high definition 1280 by 720, 1.000 square. Oh, wait, I mean 1.33 HD 1080. No, go to that, use that, sorry. Um, frame rate 29.970 NTSC with 5 seconds per keyframe. And override default compression buffer. Click that and make it 3 and make this 100. Bit rate, keep that the same. And think of a project and make sure you have that on best. And after that you can save it and it'll be amazing quality hopefully and it'll be just like mine